KPM. Okay. Yay! Oh, okay. you're doing great there. Ooh. I'm trying to get my ooh, my favorite color. Oh, I got this. What are you doing, Shafika? Um, teacher, I'm actually catching some fishes. I'm trying to get my favorite color, ooh. yellow. Mm. Oh, oh yeah. There you go. But ooh. I don't see any hook on your rod. Um, no, it doesn't have it. Oh, mm -mm. so how can you catch the fish? Uh, Did you use any bait? I no, I don't think so. Mm, I'm not too sure. Wait, how about yours? Yeah, I have something quite similar with that. Mm hmm. Mm. Aha! Ah. Ah. They're magnets! Assalamualaikum and salam sejahtera. You're watching Didi TV KPM with me, Shafika Farahin. And for the whole half an hour today, we'll be learning for slot tahap satu. And our uh, our subject for today, sorry, is science DLP or dual language program for year one pupils. And right now, as you can see just now from our profile, we have our teacher with us who's going to be teaching us for the whole half an hour today, who is none other than teacher Nina. Hi. Hi. Hi, hi teacher, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. How are you, Shafika? I'm great and I'm looking forward to learning about magnets. Yeah. But before that, I would first like to introduce as well our sign language interpreter who is teacher Kulina from SMK Sultan Abdul Samad Petaling Jaya, Selangor. Hi teacher Lina. All right, thanks for being with us here right now. Okay, teacher, now that our uh, topic is about magnets, mm -hmm. what about magnets are we going to be discovering today? Okay, so first of all, we are going to learn about the six shapes of magnets. Mm. Ah, okay, let's look at the first one. The first one is, as you can see in front of you, Shafika, yes. is the button magnets. Button. Ah, button magnets. Ah. Okay. The first one on your right. This one. And yes. So okay. the example. Yeah. Uh-uh. Okay. Next one, teacher. Oh, that is not button magnets. That's not button. It's this it's one. It's that one. <laughs> okay. Oh, it has no holes in center. Yes. That's why we call it button magnets. magnets. Okay. okay. Next one, we have the U-shaped magnet. The U-shaped -shape magnet. It's shaped as a U? Yes, it is. Ah, so you can see that it's called U-shaped magnets. Okay. Okay. Next one is the cylinder magnet. The uh, cylinder. Cylinder. Oh, oh. but it's, mm, it looks like a battery oh. dry cell. Mm -mm. Uh, but it's actually magnet. Okay. Okay. Next one here we have the horseshoe magnet. Horseshoe teacher. Ah, horseshoe. Oh. Why is it called horseshoe? Ah, because the shape is like the shoe of horse. Oh. Can you compare it with the U-shaped magnet? It, it looks, looks kind of the same. Mm -mm. Ah, but as you can see, the horseshoe magnet, the ends of it are a little bit closer. Mm -mm. Ah, so that's the difference between U-shaped magnet and horseshoe, horseshoe. magnet. Okay. okay. And next one, we have ring magnet. The oh, ring, ring magnet. Hole in the middle, oh. it's like a donut or a ring. Okay, <laughs> Ooh, these big ones. ones you have there, yes. Uh -uh. All so right, that is the ring magnet. magnet. Oh, and I can feel something Ooh. here. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, teacher. Okay, so and the last but not least is the bar magnet. The um, bar magnet. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, uh, this is the bar magnet. Shafika, mm -hmm. would you like to hold it? Ah, this um, one looks like a chocolate bar. Ah, chocolate bar. I <laughs> like chocolates. Do you like chocolates? I love chocolates, <laughs> teacher. Aha, uh -huh. mm. so these are the six 
shapes of magnets that everyone should know. Ah, ah okay. Let's repeat them. We have button magnet. Button magnet. Mm -hmm. And then what else, Shafika? We have cylinder magnet. Cylinder magnet. <gasps> the U shape magnet. U shape magnet. Horseshoe. Horseshoe magnet. Ring magnet. Ring magnet. And, and the last one, the bar magnet. Yeah, you are right, Shafika. Mm. Mm. So these are the shapes of magnet that is very common that we can see all around us. Right. Yeah. But I have a question, teacher. Mm -hmm. We know about all these magnets, but what are their use? Ah, what are the uses of the magnets? Mm. Okay, let's discuss about it. Okay. So, as we said just now, there are a few uses of magnets that we see in our everyday lives. Mm -hmm. Can you give some, like, some examples, Shafika? Where do we see magnets that we always use? Hmm, we always use, right, teacher? Mm -hmm. um, I think sometimes when we have a, a pencil case, uh -huh. my one uh -huh. my is magnetic. Oh. When I open it and close it, it becomes like pop. Oh. Because there's a magnet there. Yes. Oh, I think there's one in front of you. This yeah. one. Can you show it to everyone? Yes. Ah, so you can see the magnet there. That mm -mm. is the use of a magnet. Uh -huh. So the the pencil case will stay closed. Mm -hmm. ah. It doesn't fall. Yeah. Ah, it's tight. Yay. All right. And then another use of magnet mm -hmm. that we always see is... Mm -mm. Ah. The refrigerator door. <gasps> the refrigerator but door. We don't actually see it, but we use it every day. Oh, really? You know, like the door, uh -huh. uh, it has magnets inside. Oh. So that's why when we leave it open, it will close by itself. No uh, wonder. Because there is a huge magnet there. Mm -mm. Ah, oh, okay. usually I'll just see the rubber there, uh, but it's inside, inside there's the rubber. Magnet. Oh. Yeah. Now I know. Uh -huh. mm. Ah, Shafika, what about your handbag? Do you My think handbag? your handbag has magnets on it? <gasps> oh, it does, teacher. Uh -huh. That's a good example. Yes. No wonder sometimes when I'm rushing uh -huh. and I want to close my bag really fast, it just snaps on really fast. Yay. Ah. And your handbag stays closed, right? Yes. Mm. And here are other examples mm -mm. of magnets. Okay. Um... Ooh. These are actually decoratives that we use. Usually when we go for holidays or we go travel, we buy the fridge magnet, right? Right. Um, and then for teachers at school, they mm -hmm. have um, their uh, marker pens mm -hmm. with magnets. So that, oh, where's my marker pen? Oh, it's here. It's there. And also the duster, the whiteboard duster, also is magnetic, some of them. Oh. And the colourful ones here are actually uh, whiteboard uh, magnets mm -hmm. to hold notes and things like that. So ah. there is a lot of use for magnets, yes, right, teacher? Mm -mm. And ah, some people might see this as a normal screwdriver, mm -hmm. but we have magnetic screwdriver nowadays. We do. Yes, because sometimes we need to screw something up above us and it's quite dangerous to hold. Screw, yes, to yeah. hold. So, mm. if we use a magnetic screwdriver, it will stay. Ah, ah yeah. that's how it works. Mm, yeah. Or sometimes when the wood that we want to screw it into is very deep and we cannot reach it with our fingers, yes. that's very useful as well. Mm. Mm. So, can you think of other uses of magnets? Mm. Ah, I think you should um, tell your friends and mm -hmm. share with your teacher mm -hmm. and present it to everyone. What are the other uses of magnets? I'm sure our pupils and friends at home, they can think of many things. There's so many uses of magnets that we can find at home, right teacher? Oh yeah. Uh -huh. <gasps> your name, name tag. Oh. Yes, also use magnets. That ah. means I thought that was a pin. Ah. No, it's <laughs> no. magnets. Yes. They are the pin type and mm -hmm. also magnet type. So why do we have magnet type when we have pins? Why do why? we have that? Ah, because sometimes you do not want to puncture our clothes with a pin. Oh. So it is maybe it is safer to use magnets instead of pins. Alright, teacher. Ah. But I'm wondering as well, we have a lot of types of magnets here. Mm -hmm. Maybe perhaps they suit to different causes. Ah. We don't know, right, teacher? Yes. But we'll find out more after this. So stay tuned to DDTV KPM. We'll be right back here.
KPM Hi pupils, welcome back to Tahap Satu and today our subject is Science DLP with me Kak Shafika and also teacher Nina. Um, I just dropped a button just now teacher oh. and I noticed that my button is a button magnet. Oh, and we have loads more magnet out there that you can discover such as cylinder magnet, U-shaped magnet, horseshoe magnet and many more. Mm -hmm. But right now I can see a lot of objects in front of us teacher. Oh. I'm wondering what we're going to be doing okay so hmm. now we are going to see magnet reaction uh, how magnets will react to mm -hmm. objects around us okay ah, so everyone you can try this at home just find anything you can see um, anyway in front of you and you just need one magnet it can be a button magnet mm -mm. a bar magnet whatever magnet that you have mm -hmm. you can use it and try and see the reaction Oh, right. All right. So, shall we do it now? Yes, Shafika? let's do it. I okay. can't wait. So, Shafika, you mm. have your bar magnet over there. Okay. And I have one too. <gasps> so, there mm -hmm. are a few objects here in the tray. Mm -hmm. Ah, let's try one by one. Shafika, would you like to start with anything? Okay, I want to see if this key actually works. All right. Oh. Oh. Huh? It Ooh. sticks. Wow. Ah, so keys mm -mm. are objects attracted to magnets. magnets. Okay. okay, so you can place it here. Here you go. Place. Oh, okay. All right. So we are actually mm -mm. Uh, doing some classification. Uh -huh. uh, we are going to classify these objects, mm -hmm. uh, whether they are attracted to magnets or not attracted to magnets. Okay, teacher. But before mm -hmm. we proceed, mm -hmm. I'm just wondering, mm -hmm. you know, why are they the blue colour and then the red colour uh, on actually, a magnet? Ah, the colours are not really important actually. Mm -mm. They're just to show the poles of the magnets. The poles. Ah, so we are going to learn about that a little while. Let's just finish <gasps> okay. our activity here. Let's okay. play this Now one it's first. my turn. Mm -hmm. I'm going to try with this uh, rubber cock. Okay. Oh. 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 Mm. It's not attracted to the magnets. It is so not. Can we place them over there? Okay. Place it over there. Okay. All right. So rubber coat okay. does not attract magnets. Mm -hmm. okay. My turn. All right. Um, I'm going to try this building block. Oh. Oh. It's not sticking. Okay, let me see. <gasps> oh. No. It's mm -mm. not sticking. Okay. I don't think it's attracted to magnets mm. as well. So let's put this ah. here. Now let's see. I have a 10 cent coin here. Okay. Ah. <gasps> oh, hey, it sticks. sticks. So wow. it is attracted to magnets. magnets. So later when you have coins in your pockets, you oh. can use a magnet to take <laughs> it out. <Yeah. laughs> it's so easy. Yes. All right, my turn. I'm going to try this bottle. Mm -hmm. it's, it's glass. Glass bottle. Glass bottle. I'm going to see if it attracts. Oh, oh, it doesn't. Oh, it's mm. not attracted to oh, the magnet. No. So it okay. goes here. All right, mm. now I'm going to try with this marble. marble. It's also made of glass. Uh -huh. oh, wait, no. Mm. Oh, it's not sticking. No. It's mm. not attracted to magnet. Okay, let's do more, teacher. Yay. I'm going to try this spray. Uh -huh. And then <laughs> okay. we'll have... This magnet, oh, oh, it's sticky. Yes, wow. okay. Okay, so this one is attracted, attracted to, magnets. to magnets. All right, ah. here you go, teacher right. Nina. Okay, mm -hmm. I'm gonna try with, ah, there's another coin, but this is 20 cent new coin. Uh -huh. Can we try? Okay, let's try. Hey. Oh, it is not attracted. Oh, so it wasn't like the 10 yeah. cent just now. Oh, this is a new discovery. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So the 20 cent mm -hmm. um, 
gold colored coin mm -hmm. is not attracted to magnets. Yes. Okay. Ah, okay. All right, I'm going to try this balloon. Uh -huh, I'm oh. going to try with this mirror. Okay, this does not oh, attract mm, magnets. That's not attracted to the magnet. Uh-huh. And, and then this pebble. This mm, one. No. Oh. This one does. Paper yes. clip. It's a paper clip. All right. Put it Go here. on your side. Okay. Mm. It's a popsicle stick. Oh, mm. it does not. Oh, this one doesn't as well. Okay. <gasps> we have the last one, yep. teacher. Yeah. A ping pong oh. ball. Ping mm. pong ball. No. no. But I have one extra thing uh -huh. for you. Okay. Ooh. Do you think this will be attracted to the magnet? Can we try it? Okay. Let's try. No. no. But actually, there's something inside there. A surprise oh. for you. Really? Okay, try and dig your <gasps> magnet bar magnet. Okay. Uh, oh, I okay. can hear a click. Uh huh. <gasps> what is sticking to? <gasps> oh, paper clip. Paper clip. So you can see this is another use mm -hmm. of magnets. Okay. Okay. So All right. they do attract magnets Yay. here. Okay, so just put it here. Mm -hmm. Okay, now Shafika, you were asking just now All right. about the colors of the magnet, right? I was. And as you can see, there's actually a letter here and mm -hmm. here. N stands for North mm -hmm. and S is South. South. These are the poles of the magnets. Mm -mm. Ah, okay, Shafika. Mm -hmm. Let's do an activity now and All I right. want you to feel something. Okay. Okay. Let's try. Um, put these two together. Uh -huh. North and North. All right. Do you feel anything? I feel like uh, it's, it, not it, it, it's not sticking, sticking at all. It's not yes. even pulling. Yeah. Mm. Okay, now you change south. Okay? Oh, ah, it it's sticks. sticking. So there's different poles uh -huh. will be attracted to each other. Okay. Okay, but the same pole does uh, not. Uh, it will repel. Actually, if you use your mm -mm. own magnets, mm -mm. you can feel it. That, like there's something pushing uh, it. Yes, like it doesn't want to stick together. Yay! All repulsion. And the same goes with ring magnet and mm -hmm. also a button magnet. Okay. okay, it's the same thing. If if it's this, uh, see, we cannot stick it together. There's like there's something repulsion. That's mm -hmm. a repulsion. You cannot. But uh huh. See, it oh, sticks. So okay. actually, we can do an activity now. I have one toy car for you. All right. And one stick with a magnet. Oh, ah. okay. So both has magnets and on their ends. Uh huh. Okay, let's try. Do not touch. Okay. Okay. The cars. Yes. Okay. Don't touch the cars. Get uh -huh. nearer to you. Mm hmm. Okay. So. Try and do like this. Okay, Shafika, ready? Okay. Ready? Okay. One, One, two, two three. Hi. Hey? Oh, ah. so it's pushing the yeah, car without touching the car. <gasps> wow, ah, this is a fun game. Yes. But this means that it's repelling. Yes, yeah, so if it repels, that mm -hmm. means are the poles the same or different, Shafika? The poles must be the same. North and North, South and South. Yes, that is correct. So, mm. because the poles are the same, so they will uh, avoid each other. Oh, ah. Actually, we can make a race out of this, right? We can. Do you want to race? <laughs> or <Okay>. later? <laughs> it's fine. Okay. And that is the button magnet. Mm -hmm. This is the U-shaped magnet. U-shaped magnet. Okay. 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 How do you want to... Okay. Um, north and, and south. south. All okay. right, let's see if it sticks. Yay, it, does. it does. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, okay. That's a bit tough. Mm -hmm. And okay, you turn it. So okay. we have the same poles. Same poles now. Okay. Oh, oh. Ooh, yeah. I feel like it's pushing. Yeah. Oh, oh. it doesn't stick. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So now we know that there are two poles of a magnet, mm -hmm. and different poles will be attracted to each other, and the same poles will. Repel. Repel. Oh, oh, interesting. Right, I've learned a lot for this segment, mm -hmm. teacher. And I believe we have a lot more to learn after this. Yes, we do. But before that, let's take a short break first. Okay. And we'll be right back on Diddy TV KVM.
Dedek TV KPM Hi people, we'll, we'll still tune in to Dedek TV KPM for our slot tahap 1 today and our subject is Science DLP and right now with teacher Nina, I believe we are going to play a game and Yes, teacher. we will <gasps> okay. What game is that? So this is a very simple game using magnet magnets that you can make at home. Okay. So what you need is just a card, a piece of card, maybe um, a paper it would be too thin. Mm -hmm. uh, and then you just make the game, whatever game you want. Ah, right. you just use a magnet and also something that can be attracted to magnets. Uh -huh. uh, we okay. learned just now that the things that are attracted to magnets, did you notice anything um, similar between all the key, yes. uh, the coin, mm -hmm. the paper clip, all those are made of? Metal. Yes, metal. Mm. So, for example, we have a nut here. Right. And then maybe if you have a figurine, a small figurine, mm -hmm. you can just stick it. Or you can also use a paper clip. Okay. Uh, make a, like a character with your paper clip. Mm, uh, interesting. Then, okay. So, Shafika, would uh -huh. you like to hold that up? Okay. okay. This paper up. Uh huh. All right. So, this is just like a maze. Uh -huh. uh, a simple maze that you can make. You can make more interesting ones. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, Shafika, you right. can try and play with it. Okay. So there you, you go. Here. <gasps> ah. Oh, polar opposite. Yay. Okay. okay. Let's play this game. Ah. Wow. The snowman is going really fast. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> I have to be careful. Yeah. <laughs> Let's start again. Okay. Or we can start from here. All right. Okay, teacher. Uh huh. Oh. There you go. All right. Let's continue. Be mm. careful. Actually, you can make with other figurines if you have small cars Ooh. or a picture of uh, your favorite character. Mm -mm. Uh, it can be just a picture. As long as you attach it to a metal, right, yes, teacher? Yes, you are right. Uh -huh. ah, okay. Oh, he doesn't want to move oh. anymore. He's tired. <laughs> he's tired. Okay. But he's still sticking up here. All right. Okay, teacher. That's good. What okay. else can we play? So now, mm -mm. with that game, mm -hmm. I have actually prepared questions for you, Shafika. Oh, there's a question. Okay, okay. yes. So, now I have a toy train mm -hmm. with metal uh, rollers underneath. Okay. So, hopefully it will stick to the magnet. Alright. Oh. Yes, it does. Yes. Okay. So, let's try. Okay, mm -hmm. Shafika. Okay. Okay. Question number one. Question ready? number one ready. I've got okay. train ready. Choo-choo train. Choo-choo. Which one is the Horseshoe magnet. Horseshoe. Okay. Chaka 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 chaka. Oh, my train is okay. not functioning okay. well. Okay. It's okay. Let's Maybe we can use a stronger magnet. Okay. Yes, I see. Oh, oh. Okay. He doesn't want to move forward. Okay. Let's do this. We'll have it slanted a bit. Ah, okay. And then have him here. All right. And then chaka 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 choo choo. Oh, there you go. Ah, teacher. Okay. Is this correct? Is that correct? Yes, that is a horseshoe magnet. <laughs> Yay! Very good. Okay, okay next. another question. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which one is the button magnet? Button magnet. Choco, 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 Ah, break. Is that right? Oh, there's a hole in... In the middle? No, it's not. Oh, this is the ring magnet. That's a wrong destination train. Can I try again? Yes, you may. Okay, chaka chaka here. Yay, oh. you are right, Shafika. Thank you, teacher. Do we have another one? Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Which one is the U-shaped magnet? The U-shaped magnet. Okay. Chaka 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 that's the correct destination. How okay. was my performance just now? Oh, Do I, get... I think you did very, very well, Shafika. Mm -hmm. Congratulations. You earned Thank six you. stars. Six stars. Ah. All right. Do we want to go on with this game? Perhaps? I think, yeah. Mm -hmm. I really like playing with this. It's so fun. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, mm, which one is the cylinder magnet? The cylinder magnet is a bit far, so mm -hmm. we have to speed. Ooh. There you go. That's right. That's oh. a cylinder 
the magnet. All right, DJ Nina, uh -huh. I had so much fun playing this game, and I'm pretty sure you had too. So make your own game, right, teacher? Yes, it's very easy. Now that we've reached the end of the class, perhaps you can share a bit of a short conclusion with us. Okay, so we have learned the six shapes of magnets, mm -hmm. the uses of magnets, and how magnets react to different objects around us. Mm -hmm. And also, we have known about the two poles. Mm -hmm. Same poles will be repelling if there's a repulsion, if we stick to the two same poles, but different poles will attract each other. All right. And last but not least, just now, we have created a simple game with magnets. All right, Dishinina, thank you so much. And perhaps with all the effort that I did today, can I be rewarded as well? Aha, uh -huh. mm. okay, Shafika. I hope when you go back, you create one more game using magnets mm -hmm. and then, only then, I'll give you another star. <gasps> Thank you, Teacher Nina. All right, I'll do that when I get home. Now, for those of you watching, perhaps they want to do more exercises mm -hmm. for today's class. Where can they go to? Okay, you can always open your Delima account. There are a lot of things, a lot of activities for you to do with the topic of magnets. <laughs> Thank you, Teacher Nina, for teaching us Science DLP today about magnets. And also, thank you, Teacher Lina, for being our sign language interpreter. Thank you so much for watching. Till we meet again, Assalamualaikum and Salam Sejahtera. Bye-bye. Bye. Teacher, let's play.